Khalees and welcome back to today's video. Today I'm doing something that's very long overdue, a self-care routine. But before we get started, I do want to say that I realized a lot of us don't know how to take care of ourselves. I mean, including me. Some days I would just totally neglect my feelings, neglect what I need, and that's just being real. A lot of us do that and sometimes don't even realize it. So I decided to create a video to show you guys how to take care of yourself. Also, self-care is not just, you know, taking care care of yourself physically. Self-care can be shown in many different ways. Mentally, spiritually, emotionally, socially. I mean, there's so many ways you can take care of yourself. It doesn't have to be a annual event that happens at least once or twice a year. You can show yourself care every day. So, I mean, my room isn't too dirty. Like, it's not too bad, right? Right? The suitcase has been there for who knows how long. You know, the basic essentials to keep a room clean. Do your laundry, fold your clothes, you know, pick up things that are randomly on your floor. Stuff like that. So I'm going to start doing that. And that's definitely something that you can do to show yourself care. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked. And by the way, just got in town. And I won't let Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So go now, I'm So I finally finished cleaning my room, but I also want to show you guys, I don't know what this is going to be. It was supposed to be a vision board, but I saw a lot of people taking cork boards and making it a photo board. And I do have a photo printer, so I was thinking maybe I can print some photos to put them on here, but I probably need more because I don't have a lot of photos, but I thought this was super cute. I'm planning on doing a redecorating my room video soon, so stay tuned for that. So I'm just cleaning my room. It's lunchtime. Before I have lunch, <laughs> I do want to say that I'm still struggling with this as well, but food is fuel and it's not fat. Food is nutrition. I feel like sometimes we can get caught up in that whirlwind of thinking all food is bad, all food is unhealthy, and it's also a part of self-care, feeding yourself, fueling yourself, but I have some pasta and I don't eat it because... I need my nutrition for the day and you need nutrition too so if you ever find yourself thinking um, in that negative way about food thinking food is the enemy change your perspective into food is fuel and not fat all right i'm gonna eat bye Walgreens. My grandma took me to get some face mask or a face mask. I ran out of mine. Well, let's be real. Mine was two years old. My face mask 
it expired. I don't really know if face masks actually can expire. I mean, it's been in my skincare fridge, so I don't know if that makes it fresh or not. They didn't have the one that I originally, like the one I always use. They had this, and it's this Shea Moisture African Black Soap Clarif Clarifying Mud Mask. I did not know Shea Moisture sold face products. You know, Shea Moisture is a hair company. I guess this is just a new thing that they have started doing. But I'm gonna be trying this out. I'm actually kind of scared because I don't want my skin to break out. I've never used this before. I used to use their skin products, but I don't really use it that much. Okay, next I have my essential oils in my diffuser. I have become a huge fan of essential oils because they are emotionally beneficial. Okay, also something I would recommend is getting a towel because it can be a little messy. Okay, but pretty much how you do this is you take your top off. One, two. Oh, <gasps> y'all, I just did too much. definitely interesting I don't typically lean towards yoga when I think about my voice just cracked it was really fun doing it you know by myself today I did a five minute I think it was a five minute yoga session I guess but that was a great way to get into that clean clear mind before I go into my next form of self-care which is spiritual but first let's hop in the shower I just washed my face as you can see now I'm about to do this Shea Moisture mud mask you guys saw why am I scared how long are you supposed to have this on your face I have Man, I shouldn't have thrown my applicator away. I should have tested this on my hand first. Oh, wow. If my skin breaks out, okay. Oh, it's applying nicely. Hmm. Oh, it's getting in my hair. No, no, bro, no. <laughs> it's getting all over my bonnet. I just washed my hair. No, I got Smurf Ho. We're giving Smurf. All right. Oh. The moment where you have to eat your nose. I need to like get a paper towel and clean this up. Um, <laughs> this isn't working. Somebody help me. Okay, turn the water off. I'm struggling at the moment. So I will see you guys for 10 until 10 minutes after this has dried and it's ready to rinse off. In the meantime, I'm gonna read a book. This book is called Love Is a Revolution and it's all about self-love, finding to love yourself. So my camera died and now I have to film my phone. The timer just went off. It's semi-dry like there are these big parts. It feels really weird. It's super tight on my face. I'm gonna get the rest off of my face. I don't see you guys when I'm finished with that. 
it honestly left my face a little dry so I had to put some moisturizer on. I'm just gonna do the rest of my skincare routine and I'll see you guys for the last step to have the ultimate self-care routine. Above all things, spiritual self-care is what matters the most. While you are on your self-care adventure, take some time out of your day and spend time with God. Devotion doesn't have to be long. Just 10 minutes out of your day can make everything 10 times better. Like I said, there are so many forms of self-care, including having a family movie or game night. This is an example of social self-care and is by far my favorite. 